Hello YouTube, it is Jack and MK FIFA from the FIFA Gamers bringing you another video. I know you guys love these videos, so we're gonna do it for you. Right, this is just my armor team and like how I got it and some tips. Basically, I'll show you the active squad. And I'm oh. lagging a bit because Mike wanted me to share a screen with him. So I think that's as strong <laughs> as it goes. Ah, I just cut my foot. Uh, and this guy Boy. here, Idli, right, um, he looks completely different on the actual game. So that's the strongest team. Obino is 72. Fuck off. He's got 85 pace, 72 shots. I, I think we should do the tips first. No, I'll show you the team ball. first. Nice, no, alright. Yeah, um, yeah. I went for a bit of pace because, like, if you use a silver defence, you need pace in it just so you can keep up. So you have 80 pace, 75 pace, 70 pace, and 80 pace. Not the slowest. Ben Foster and goal. Uh, yep. Yeah. In the centre mid. I have three players that can all take a cracker of a free kick. This guy has decent stats with 87 shot power and he can also take a penalty. Not much this pace. <laughs> that not much pace either. Yeah, 71 pace, yeah. That's got 59. Personally, got 67. I have to have decent pace, like eight, around 80 pace for a player. I can't really do that yet. I don't yeah, really I like need it. that in my back four, but I don't need it in the centre mid, to be honest, because I've been there here and by more. You just pass it out then. Yeah, right. just all they do is play it forward to either Odonwingi, Obina or Balmoy. So basically he's got 87 shot with I think about high 70 free kick stats. He's got all 83s and I think 184. This guy's got about 83, 75, 75, something like that. So they can all take a pretty beast free kick. And then my front line, I have this guy, Odonwingi, or sometimes I just swap him out there, my subs, Cohen. Murphy, Campbell, Bossejour, Mahil, Gabidon and Bradage. These are about the same player apart from Ian Goal's good shot. I have Walco who's a bit quicker than my right back but not as good in Collison and Bell Ben I am, yeah. So he has eighty five pace, seventy two shot. I like a bit of pace, but pace. in yeah, eighty five, yeah. But um Barm away and the left forwards, uh, the quickest one I can find is seventy nine and eighty. I need more pace than that in the left forward to be honest. Then up strike I have Odin Wingy, he's not the quickest but he has a pretty big shot. And then on the bench I have Campbell. So you said. Yeah, just looking at it. And it's got under chemistry. Three and a half star team. I like coming against the noobs. So smash them. why did you choose a silver team then? Pretty much because I just wanted to. I don't know. I had like I had my Premier League team, but I wasn't doing too well on it. I was like winning. Yeah. Like I was winning like out of ten games. No, I don't play ten games a day. So five games. I won three, lost two. It's like to piss me off. My record ain't that good because I used to have a te uh, connection that also always used to lag me out, as Michael know. And yeah, so that's pretty much my team. Pretty yeah, pretty much. So basically, you know, if you get, if you're gonna get if you're gonna get an I armor team and you start yeah. splashing the cash on gold, it's gonna be harder for you. It's exactly. gonna be much harder to play with. So if this say if you vary it out with silvers, exactly. golds, if you want, I don't know, bronzes in your teams or that's what I mean, you, you do, don't you? Yeah, that's what I do. I basically vary it out and um, you know, it's all like good. is eighty one strike with a bronze or a silver. So so when when I do that, I literally win nine out of ten games. So it's all exactly. good. I don't mind doing it. And I'm better at FIFA, no I'm joking. Probably am. <sighs> right, here's the trade pile, wait till yeah. it loads. <laughs> this Philadelphia kit. Uh, I bought that and these are still not selling. I was trying to price fix them. I bought two of them. Well, one out of a pack on one that I actually got. And that is a pretty nice kick because it's gold with a blue stripe. So that's 1.4k that went for. I got it out of a pack. And that was out of the 1.5k packs. So that pretty much paid for itself, that pack. And, and that's also good when, you got, when you're only one card, basically. Because if you've got only one selling a card in the market, you can price lock it or whatever you want. Yeah, as long as so it's not out of reason, yeah. then you can make it higher than it's actually worth. And that way it's going to give you more money. Price locking, yeah. This is not right, sell. Yeah. And this is just, it used to go for about 950 to a K because I don't know if you can see that, but it's a Void Jeans logo. I'll quickly check because I want to re-list that. List that is a bronze. Oh, shit, it needs to be club information. I'm a bit of an idiot. Uh, Barclays Premier League, I think they're in. What are they? Empire and why he's doing that, Father Tips. Basically, when you want to start off on your own team, you want to be going for a theme, basically. You, you don't want to be doing any random plays. You need Ooh, good chemistry for your team. Good. I just found out that I'm not going for as much as I want. My mate told me how you go for a lot because of the void jeans. Basically, well, I'm just going to make uh, sure I don't yeah. make a loss on the one I paid. <laughs> how much did I pay for that? And oh, all the way, by the way, that Oberton I found in the last episode wasn't that good. I sold him for how much I got him for, though. Hey, 
Oh, but he's a decent player, you know. Yeah. Nice, fast, fast skiller there. Yeah, I proved you wrong. He is fast, fast yeah. skiller. Apologies in the other video if you saw, and I was like, no, 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 no. I'm pretty sure that Obertan is four star skill, but I was wrong. Yeah. He's really five star skill. So my apologies if you saw that. Let's just hope no one saw it. Yeah. Yeah, we won't take it down though. It's your foul. <laughs> so basically, what I've been doing is wait. These packs are good because sometimes you even get squad fitnesses. Have, have you seen this new special pack? Oh, it's gone. It was a 50k one. I had 30 items. People were getting some beast informs. Yeah, I'll just buy this now because you normally get some squad fitnesses. So overall. Seven rares. Yeah, that seven rares. Very nice. You got so, a lot more chance of getting a good player. I mean, I've bought three of them. I've made profit on all of them. Some, that ma that one with a gold kit, I made about a K profit because I also had a pacey guy with about 81 pace. Obviously, it's pacey then. Oh, obviously, for a bronze guy, I need to pull my mic out. So, overall, if you want to jump into the gold guys, you sh and you're not like the best at FIFA, I wouldn't advise it because you come up with yeah, a, you a lot be of strong opponents. If you're starting off with FIFA, what you want to do is you want to keep the team that they give you first for a little bit, just play with it, play one or two games, get some coins, uh, then you want to start investing on your team. You don't want to just go straight, ah, oh, like, like that gold player. I'll buy them because as soon as you start getting gold players, you're gonna get paired up to a lot higher than you are. So what you want to do is you want to keep the theme. You want to make a theme with all your players. Get some silvers in there. Get some bronzes in there. Get some golds in there. Just mix it all up. Miss, uh, obviously you're all in the same nationality, club or league or whatever you want. Whatever you're doing on the f on your theme, it could be whatever. You could do it like the French league, French nationality, whatever. Syria um, is good. You get good players for cheap, and also make sure like when you buy someone, oh see, oh he's a cheap gold, and also look at his formation, his position. So if you're gonna play him right mid, think about if he's right wing to get that most chemistry. You're gonna have to buy a right wing to right mid card, which is gonna cost you a bit, and formation costs. Yeah. So what I always do, I'm a bit weird, like a bit OCD. Always go make sure it's in the right. So overall, don't jump into gold straight away, and that's about it. So peace out, guys. Do you want to say anything, Mike? Right, FIFA Games has been here. It's your boy MK FIFA. Peace.